I might be a little bit biased, but the best wrestling shoe of all time is finally here. In all seriousness, if it isn't obvious already, I am dropping my own signature wrestling shoe. I posted a video, I think about a month ago, just explaining that uh, I do have my own shoe coming out. I had the samples, but now I have my hands on the actual pairs that will be releasing Friday, September 20th at 6 p.m. Central Time. So by the time you guys are watching this, heck, the shoes might even be out, but I'm planning on uploading this just about 24 hours before the release date. If you guys were keeping track of me on TikTok through Instagram, you guys would have known for uh, past couple days that these would be releasing. Nonetheless, we will be releasing 100 pairs in each colorway, the greens, the golds, the black and silver, but then 250 pairs in the Clash of Combat colorway. And in this video, I'm gonna be telling you everything new about this shoe, what this means for myself and the community, how you're able to get your hands on your own pair, and even the key perks and benefits that you can get if you purchase one of these shoes. Now this process has taken me over a year to legit finally complete, and this all wouldn't be possible if it wasn't for Brock, who's helping with the manufacturing and doing all of the shipping. But starting off on the first colorway over here, we have the black and silver. We're gonna call this one the Strictly Business. The business type shoe, nothing too flashy about it. Got the OG gum bottoms, if you guys know wrestling shoes, think about the Maflex. The, I feel like the gum bottom is just a staple in the wrestling community. It looks just so clean on a shoe. Can honestly just match with anything. No matter what your single colorway is, this can always match with it. Now a big visual design with the new shoes is that the logo is actually stitched. There's not much stitched logos in wrestling shoes anymore, and that's something that I wanna bring back. It's just so clean, it makes it so much more professional, and heck, that's even gonna last longer, unlike the printed on embossed logos. Of course, for the lace design, it has this little strap for the zipper, zipper them down. When you guys get the shoes, it actually will come with laces, so if you guys are worried that it's gonna slip off your foot, I can, you know, promise you, it, it's never happened to me, but I take all the laces out and I don't even need to have the laces, I just zipper them up. But if you guys do wanna keep the laces in there, their laces do actually come under the zipper. So just tie your laces, put them on under, zip them up, and you're good to go. Now the Golden Glory colorway, this one, it's gotta be my favorite. I mean, look how bright these look. I can see myself on the screen. These shoes are just super, super bright. Also, you guys can probably see like the vibrant colors. They're so much more vibrant than the previous samples. I'm super happy about that. And once again, the golden is stitched on there. Also, it's kind of sparkly. It's got the sparkly CH logo on the bottom. Really love that. Fair warning, these are white wrestling shoes. If you guys have owned any white wrestling shoe, they're gonna get dirty, especially if you if you practice in them like day in and day out and even in competition. So if you're like me, you wanna keep your wrestling shoes pretty, heck, I might only wear these for competition, but might just wear them for a practice to maybe even work them in, just make sure my foot doesn't get blisters. Regardless, this has gotta be the cleanest shoe coming out in my collection. I just absolutely love the green sole on this one. I mean, I don't think there's much green soles, even just green wrestling shoes in general. Of course, being Parkside, that's where I go to college, this is gonna be the shoe I think I'm gonna be wearing a ton. And you can see this one does not have a zipper. And actually the logo up here is nice and big. That's also stitched on there. And we went with kind of a, I know the samples actually had silver lining right here, but we chose just to make it more green, just to kind of fill out the shoe a little bit. And I can tell you for duels, definitely busting this one out more than often. Another thing I mentioned on the heel, you can actually see, we actually have uh, the custom insoles, has a logo on there as well. Super, super squishy. Like I'm talking like comfort to the mass. A lot of people who have came around to my camps and clinics throughout the summer, like in a various of states, everyone who has put on the shoe said it was like one of the comfiest shoes that they've ever put on. It's got the nice ankle support, legit just hugs your foot. And of course it's super squishy on the insole there. And the soles aren't too hard, but they're also not too soft either. And of course, like all of them, it features that push bubble there in the back. Last but not least, we have the Clash of Combat shoe. Of course, with the OG colors from the podcast, you guys know myself and Crosby, we're the hosts of the Clash of Combat podcast. Just like all the shoes, I have my uh, signature there on the inside of the heel, but it's kind of cool. We got Crosby's signature on this one too. This one does in fact feature the zipper. This one's super bright too, because I feel like the red, uh, the red lace cage with, with the zipper, of course, it's super bright. I really wondered how it would look on the green ones as well. Maybe if you guys do want a zipper in the green ones, we can definitely come out with that for the future. And again, with the logo down here stitched, this is like the cleanest stitching I've seen. The colors, super vibrant, will definitely pop on the wrestling mat. And also, it's not like a white shoe. You can wear these throughout practice. And even the ones I've been wearing for the past like four months, they honestly don't even look dirty at all. But of course, that helps when you have a black sole and just the black overall of the shoe. So Kaden, where will these be releasing? Well, just as I said before, they're releasing 
releasing this Friday, September 20th at 6 p.m. Central Time. So if you guys wanna have a timer or put it on your calendar, because odds are a lot of these sizes are gonna sell out very, very fast. There's legit limited quantity. There's as much as 250 pairs in the Clash of Combat colorway, but with the sizes, sizes range from four to 13, so that's 10 sizes. So we only have, let's say, 25 pairs in each size. So 25 in size nine, 25 in size 10, and that's it. I'm not gonna say if we're ever even gonna make these again, because nothing is on order, at least for a long time. And when you think about the stealth greens, the golden glories, the strictly business, there's only 10 in each size. And basically I have a size, I have a size eight and two size nines, a couple size tens. So that means there's only like eight other ones of these, seven other ones of these in each size that you basically can get. So they're gonna go super fast. So make sure to set your alarms and be ready to purchase. Now all these shoes will be available on my website. The website might not be out as this time is talking because we don't want you guys to purchase the shoes yet. But once it is live, I'll be posting it on this YouTube video linked in the description below, but I'll also be uploading an array across TikTok, Instagram, and also here on YouTube. We're just gonna have like a, honestly like a big party for the release party. I'm filming something super cool, gonna be live streaming it there. This is such a cool opportunity. This is legit a dream come true. When I first started wrestling 17 years ago, uh, one of my first shoes, I th actually think it was my second wrestling shoe. It was the Jordan Burroughs A6 wrestling shoes. And I'm like, holy cow, this is, this is a guy who has a signature on a shoe, like this is his shoe. This is something that he can call his own. And he was someone I really looked up to in the wrestling world, you know, even to this day. Heck, he just made his 12th world team, so JB, GOAT status. I remember getting posters as a kid, and it was always my dream where I'm like, heck, if someone can else can have their own wrestling shoe, have their name on it, have it like a product to the wrestling community, someone else can wear it. I just really love being a creator and creating things, especially here in this wrestling community. You guys have given me so much throughout the years. You guys are the only reason that I'm able to do this and honestly just like live my life. Like this is like my, my career now and saying that I do YouTube, social media content as a career, it's, it's legit a dream come true. I remember nights, uh, countless nights like for months on end when I would just be like, dude, what am I gonna do with my life? I'm working so hard on YouTube, I'm making these videos, I'm getting nowhere, I'm getting 100 views, no one cares, people at school are making fun of me. Heck, when times were going bad in high school, didn't make it to state, oh, coming up short just again and again and again, I'm like, heck, is this really for me? Is this mountain too tough to climb? But I believed in myself so much. And I'm saying that because if I can do that, if I can say that, if I can believe that, then you can too. You guys have just been such a big part of my wrestling journey. Like doing this, I think has made me just a better wrestler, keeping me accountable to show up every day, to do my best, to work the hardest. And I personally wanna be along you in your journey with wrestling, whether that's climbing, you know, the state rankings, the tournament rankings, heck, winning your first tournament, winning your first state tournament, heck, going off and winning things that I have never dreamed possible. So that being said, I appreciate you guys so much who all just support me and the shoes and just everything I do. And I promise you that I will do my best to bring the best content into the wrestling community. Now, if you guys do get your hands on a pair of my wrestling shoes, here's a couple cool things I was thinking about. And I need your guys' help because I want you guys to be able to have a say in what you wanna do as more of the giveaway or basically to win something. Now I was thinking the first day title worn in one of these wrestling shoes here, we're gonna have a cash reward. So whatever you guys think is fair, heck, a thousand bucks if you win the first day title in this wrestling shoes, 5K, 10K. Okay, maybe, maybe, not, maybe not that much. I'm still in college. But basically depending how the shoe sales go, that also depicts on if we can do a higher cash reward or even I was thinking too, is no matter where you are, I would come to you. We would basically film like a mini documentary series, just basically talking about your wrestling story, making it like a hype up promo. Honestly, just a great resource that you can like almost share to college coaches of, hey, this is who you are, this is what you've done. I just wanna help you out in every way that you can. Another idea that I had is, let's say again sticking on the state tournament is if you win a state tournament in the shoes that you get basically the whole next year of wrestling shoes or basically a Caden Henschel shoe every year for life of course that we uh, continue to do this but let me know any other ideas in the comments that you guys have uh, basically me and Brock being the two guys who are like owning this entire thing we have the a complete control of what we want to do so whether that be giving away more pairs take me down for a pair of shoes or whatever that may be i really want to be a staple in the wrestling shoe community and we're only going to make it better from here heck this is uh this is my first rodeo this is my first time ever doing this so please bear with me uh don't take me too harsh but i, I can tell you that i personally love 
love these shoes. I would not be sitting here and telling you I do not love them if I didn't actually love them. I wear these shoes legit every time I'm in the wrestling room, other than maybe one or two times because I don't want to keep getting them dirty and I only had the samples at the time. But with that being said, that is going to conclude this video. Once again, these are coming out this Friday, September 20th at 6 p.m. Central Time. Uh, good luck on getting a pair. I hope you guys are super, super quick. I hope you guys love the shoes. Also on social media, please tag me, post me, story share, whatever. Honestly, I'm just going to reach out to everyone that purchases an order because you guys are what's important. I want to make sure you guys really love the shoe and I just appreciate you guys, honestly, like from the bottom of my heart. Thank you. Last thing too, we're going to touch on price. The adult sizes are going to be $130 and the youth sizes are going to be $100. But this is super fun. This is super cool. Thanks guys so much for watching. I highly encourage you guys to go get yourself a pair. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you guys next video.